Hi there, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Charlotte and I am the Scrunkly Little Simmer. So on this video today, we're gonna be returning to Selena and Salim and little baby Jessie. The last time we checked in on them, things didn't really go according to plan. Um, there was some infidelity and to be honest, I wasn't expecting it, especially not with the sim that it occurred with. If you haven't seen that video, go back and watch that one before you watch this one. I, yeah, I honestly have got no idea what way things are gonna go for this series they continue to surprise me every time i log on so let's get into it okay so we've been in our house for a couple of days now we're getting closer to jesse aging up into a toddler i think my plan with this is once she is a young adult we might do a university playthrough because as long as i've had that pack um i haven't really done an awful lot with it to be honest on my little offline game at the moment i've been playing one of my sims on there but because i'm jumping between characters in like a legacy playthrough she's not doing so well we're not putting our entire simacy into our degree we're, we're flunking right now i think so yeah i think it will be quite interesting to see what a focused playthrough on that expansion will be like and i might end the selena series not end it but maybe start a new series once she goes to university let me know what you'd like to see because I want to make it enjoyable for you guys too. Okay, let's get started. Someone's going to need to wake up because the baby looks like she's going to be crying. Yeah, she's awake. Your needs are pretty good though. I don't think it's going to hurt too much if we have to get up and sort out Jessie. We don't need to deal with the baby right now. Can we just go back to bed? Go back to bed. Have you just had a coffee? Right. Time to get up. I've been thinking about what I want her to do job wise um, because ideally we want her at home while the baby is a baby so we don't have to take out any childcare but I also would still like to have two incomes in so I think I might get her to work in the freelance career which I think may also be good for her um, because she doesn't like crowds and the job she was doing before i don't know why that was our aspirate like why it ended up that way because of our aspiration but um maybe we'll think about changing that they can change their aspiration and it gives you suggestions so maybe if we start focusing on stuff that's a bit different we might get an idea of what our purpose is it's getting very existential this house is a mess I mean, it is the weekend, but it's not really an excuse, is it? Every time I see that pile of clothes on the floor next to that laundry basket, I lose my mind a little bit. Right, let's see if she likes avocado. Bit of a red flag when I find people that don't like avocado. It's delicious. It's nature's mayonnaise. What do we think? She was unsure. Ugh. I don't know why you're laughing. That was gross. I never take photos, but I see people like taking really nice pictures of their sims and i want to do that too this is real useful selena <laughs> oh my god maybe we'll try when she's not sat right next to a chair right selim you can get up i'll let you go for a wee first but i'd like you to do some washing up you need to tidy this place up it's an absolute date and then you can serve breakfast and then selena can go to the toilet and use the bath and then you can take a keep an eye on the baby you'll have some fun because we're playing you're playing on here are you a stinky baby you are a stinky baby i guess i'll get this plate then shall i he likes cooking that's a useful thing to have in a partner I mean, she's pretty good at cooking anyway. Why are you grizzling? What's the matter? You stink and you want to go sleep. Right, your mum can give you a bath in a minute when she's finished having hers. Or I suppose dad can do it because it won't take long if we do it that way. You'll live. And he says, you can get sorted after I've had my breakfast. Mans is hungry. 
I guess it's whoever gets out, whoever's free first. Oh, you can do it then. Oh no, wait, Salim's done. You can clean up Jessie. And then when you're done, you can put her back to sleep. Oh, just go to sleep. Right, let's get a job as a freelancer. Do you do it this way or do you do it with the Ministry of Labour? I honestly can't remember. Salim's on parenting level three, which is pretty good. Selena, should we maybe clean up after breakfast? I have a feeling that this is going to suit her much better. What's our writing skill like? Co-writer for kids' bedtime stories. Maybe having a child has inspired her to write her own stories. Oh, she doesn't have the writing skill at all. When is Jessie's birthday? Is that today? Is it I had you writing at different desks in mind. This was supposed to be his, this was supposed to be hers, but... You know, whatever works. Never eat your pet turtle, another advice for kindergarten. That's fine. Right, Salim is off to work today. So I think when he goes to work, or when the baby wakes up, we will go downstairs. We won't write while we're being mum, while the baby's awake. How about you read a book? I mean, you have got, you have got to go to work very, very soon. We're going to work. We're not, we're not going to the flea market. We have a family. Hopefully we'll be able to get that promotion. So while Salim is at work, we'll finish off doing what we're doing until the baby wakes up. Oh, Bess. Selena, it's official. I'm the parent of the wonderful toddler I adopted. Are you free for an introduction? I mean, yeah, we might as well. We can take the baby with us. Where's the baby? Can we not take the baby with us? Is it because she's asleep? Maybe not. We know what happened the last time. It wasn't so good for Salim, but he doesn't know that yet. Okay, so we've finished our book, have we? Yeah, we've finished the book. Can we send it off now? Wait, just while the baby's still asleep, just see if we can chat with the client. Oh yeah, she slept through the night. Good, that's another milestone unlocked. We are on track to have a happy, healthy toddler and not unhappy um, infant like all of my other sims in my trauma simulator have been. It doesn't seem to have affected most of them though, which is disappointing. God, I sound so evil when I say it like that. Can I submit it yet? Or... Oh, baby's awake. Right, Selena, we have to go downstairs and be mummy. Toe in mouth milestone unlocked. Yes, that's another one. Well done, Jessie. How are we doing for our milestones? Let's we want to get her to crawl. Maybe we can focus on that this afternoon. No! Stop sleeping with people with partners! Where are you taking her? She's hungry. Put her in the chair. She doesn't want to read your book! She hates it! Come on, she's hungry. Or did you feed her upstairs? Oh, she must have breastfed her. We do need to freshen her up though. Oh, she likes papaya! That's good. Something that she likes. Why can't I take a picture of her while she's in the chair? Why do you keep putting her un- Oh, you're so dumb. This is what happened last time. Go to the loo then. Come on. We talk less about it. And then we'll clean up Jess. Look at shuffling like that. Babes, we need to learn. What time does Salim come home from work? We can spend a bit of time sorting out the baby. You're so dirty. Right, can we practice crawling? Babel is unlocked. Oh, I don't know. You can shuffle around everywhere on a bum like. You didn't get promoted though, did you? We're gonna have leftovers for dinner. And then we wanna clean out spoiled food. Oh, you're so gross. Go and have a bath. Stink. Oh, it's Bess. Not sure this is such a good idea, Bess. We can't be doing any funny business. Boyfriend is in the shower. Why are you stinky? Are you need cleaning up. Salim can do that. She says, bitch, you stank. Stop chatting with Bess. We can do the thing that we wanted to do. Let's practice crawling with our stinky baby. God, infants really are a lot of hard work, aren't they? I wonder though, if 
cracking some of this stuff in infancy, it will help or like give me some skill levels for toddlerhood. Is that the right word? I guess. Uh, Salim's just gonna go take that to the hamper because I have to tell you to do everything. And then you, this baby is such a whinge bag. Honey, you've got to clean the baby first. You've got to clean her up. She doesn't even eat in a turkey dinner. Right, go and clean the baby up. Put her to bed. Eat your dinner. I wonder what they're talking about. Oh, video games. Good. Not banging each other again. No, don't be flirting with her. This isn't how I was expecting this to go. I didn't expect her to be having fem feelings for a female sim. I haven't even done this. This is, I think my game must just know that this is how I normally play the sims. No, we've even got like a romance bar now. Oh, so much for the happy family gameplay that I was planning on doing. Oh my God, Bess. Again, we're smoking up in my house. Right, let's power through the night. Hopefully Bess will get the hint and we'll take herself off home. We do have better compatibility with Bess. Oh no, she got a period. Go on then, go and have a bath. Go and clean yourself up. And then I think after this, we're gonna have to do some laundry. What's the matter? Oh, it's Jessie's birthday today, isn't it? We should probably make her a cake. We'll throw a birthday party. I don't know who's gonna come. Oh, we've got we've got friends with babies, haven't we? Maybe we can we can do that. It might be a good idea to make better connections with the people in the neighbourhood as well. Get out of my cupboards! Go on then, go and get some leftovers. Right, let's put our decorations away. Oh, we can change them over. We can do the winter ones in our inventory because it's no longer appropriate to have the Harvest Fest ones up. Why is the baby so stinky still? I swear, I clean it all the time. We're going to cook a birthday cake. Oh, have we still got that one in the... I bet that's spoiled. I bet that's not going to be usable. Right, you make the birthday cake because you're better at cooking. Okay, I might have got a little bit distracted just then um, and got ready for Winterfest really, really early. Because it's winter now, so that means we can get ready. Uh, he likes cooking. Why doesn't he make the cake? Come on. Ideally, I want her crawling. Well, we won't do that until Salim is back. Let's try and work on those skills. Oh, that's really cute. You're so fun to be around. I really enjoy spending time with you and I hope you feel that way about me too. Adore. Hun, you need to go and see your baby. Come on, we've got to get those motor skills up and running. Pardon the pun. Um, oh, we don't have to pay anything. Oh, we do. <laughs> Whoops. You're peeing again? You got a UTI or something? Stop putting her in that thing! No, 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 do not eat the cake. That's for later. No! Oh, you dickhead! That was for the party! Oh my god, we're going to have to make a new cake. And we're going to do another chocolate one because we can't have Salim knowing that we've eaten the cake that we made for the birthday party. You're useless. I think we've got money to be burning buying cake or making cakes. Jesus Christ. You know what? You're way more of a letdown. Salim might be lazy, but he's not eaten the birthday cake of his daughter or had an affair. I think I might hate my Sim. I'm so angry with her. Because we want to do it when Salim's home from work. You weren't even that hungry. I'm so annoyed with you. Oh yeah, just thinking about yourself, not your baby daughter. I don't want to start it just yet. 
to do it later. You don't even need to go to the toilet. Oh, is it? Okay. Come on, let's practice your crawling. We've got a couple. We've got less than an hour before your dad comes home, and then we're having a party. Why are you so anti-practice crawling? Yes. Okay, that's. I feel like getting all of the infant milestones would be easier if you were playing on like the long lifespan. I guess it would be more realistic, I guess. She's getting the hang of it. Yes! Thank fuck. Okay. Birthday party. Birthday sim, Jessie. Guests, Bess, Penny. Who else are we like friends with? Oh, she's from this area. I mean, it can be a small get together. We haven't met loads of people that live here yet. It's, it's gonna be a very small get together. we're gonna do it at the house what do you want Bess oh we need something that's gonna play music that bed's so nice um, I think we're a bit more than good friends oh we like s pop don't we let's put on let's put s pop on oh it's a kids one though isn't it we'll put it's all adults coming though. Come on, we want to have a good birthday. I can't really compliment the birthday sim, she's a tiny baby. Right, it's getting a bit late, isn't it? Right, come on, we want a good birthday. Baby, I know you're tired. Can I buy a birthday cake? Do I have to make one? Because that has gone off. Ugh! I tried to be too prepared. Ugh! I'm gonna have to make one. I'm gonna have to make another birthday cake. Am I running out? Have I run out of time? Oh, this isn't gonna be the good birthday that I wanted it to be. Can't believe I've gone through three birthday cakes. I will have gone through three birthday cakes. Salim, you can do the diaper. Oh my god. Face down, booty up. That's the way we like to work. Bake the cake. Bake the cake. Bake the cake. Bake the cake. Oh, we don't have loads of time. I wish you could buy a cake. Oh. <laughs> I tried so hard. I'm just gonna have a shit birthday. We tried. We did our best. And I think that's all you can say as a parent, isn't it? That we tried our best. Oh my goodness. Where did that cake even go? Wake up. I just want her to age up. Just let her blow the let her blow the candles out. Just that one's trash as well. Right. Just let her blow the candles out. I just wanted No, wake up. Put the candles on the cake. Put the candles on the cake. Right, and now help her blow them out. Ugh. Hopefully her next birthday will be better. We'll be a bit more prepared for it. This is why all of my sims and my offline games are so unhappy. They always have shit birthdays. Let's... We did get... Aww. Right, we need to get a new bed. Mm, I'm not gonna sell this. I'm gonna hang on to it just in case. Oh, this one's cute. Is there a base for this one? Where's the base for it? Oh, have we... Found something that works? No. Cool. There it is. Lovely. Right, let's do some stuff to this bedroom now that she's a toddler. She's going to need more stuff. We've got a toy box that looks nice. I want a nice one. I like the pink. Oh, Mr. F I think I want the fox. The bear can go. We'll have the big fox instead. 
Oh, that's so cute. I think that'll do us for now. So it's like five in the morning. I'm gonna make sure she goes to bed and then I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Let's just have a little look at her milestones. Oh, she's a happy infant though. That's what I wanted. The birthday party might have been shit, but she wasn't unhappy. Okay, what's happened? Oh my God, is this not saved properly? Has my camera died? When did that happen? No! I checked it and it was still running. Once again, I've run into technical difficulties while filming. Um, it turns out my camera ran out of battery. Thankfully, it wasn't until right towards the end, which is better than it could have been. Um, so just to catch you up on like the last bit that happened, I've given uh, Jessie's bedroom a little bit of a makeover. She's aged up um, as a happy infant, so that's really, really good. It's the best outcome I could have got, to be honest. Um, the birthday party wasn't much of a success, but it is what it is, these things happen. Um, and yeah, oh God, technology is a wonderful thing when it does what it's supposed to do, isn't it? I really need to invest in like a high quality webcam so I don't need to think about this. Anyway, thanks again for watching the video if you've made it this far. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye.